Well, you know when you watch the movies and all the women always wake up beautiful and you say, that's not possible. Well, it is if you have permanent makeup. Sally Hayes, a permanent makeup artist, says, you know what? We should all wake up beautiful, shouldn't we, Sally? Absolutely. <laughs> Especially when you can nowadays. Absolutely. Absolutely. There's nothing standing in the way of looking good except money. There <laughs> And guess what? It doesn't take much to have that permanent makeup look. Now, let's talk about permanent makeup. Where I know you do. You know, a I lot do of... the eyes, the brows, the lips. I don't do blush. I don't do permanent eyeshadow, because that's really locking yourself into a look. But I do do the eyebrows, um, you know, the eyeliner and the full lip color, which takes a lot of time off just putting those. Um, three items on every day. Right, and if you can wake up and look like you And you, can, you know, if you want to change your color and wear red, you can put it on, but I, I think what I really wanted to talk about today was people forget about their mouth. Mm. You know, they're so focused on their eyes and their brows. Right. They totally forget about the lower half of their face. Right. And lips are really important. And I think February, I think of Valentine's Day lips. <laughs> I think everybody does, <laughs> doesn't they? Well, let's take a look at uh, one of your, you have a couple of clients that you right. brought in some before and after photos of, which um, incidentally, she's a gorgeous woman. And look at this, the, the before, I mean, I, it wasn't so bad, but she we just blended right. in with her face. And you know, what I really wanted to focus on here was the lips again, Terry, because see how she has really, really low lip color, and she's lost her definition, but she's got really pretty lips. She's got gorgeous and lips. And after you follow the lips and you, you fill them in, and I don't do just the liner, because then you have ring around the mouth. I, I blush it into the lips so mm -hmm. that if she doesn't have lipstick on, this is how she looks. Now, I've also done her eyes and brows, wow. which are important, but I think the mouth makes such a difference. Absolutely, and all she really has to do at that point is throw on a little, a little bit, bit of lip, lip gloss. gloss. And, she's yeah. actually my dentist hygienist and uh, oh. dental hygienist, and she's awesome. Oh, wow. But. And you know, that's the thing now, when you, when you think about lip color, because I think a lot of people mm -hmm. might be going, well, you know, what if I, because trends and colors change, right. right? Now see, this gal here has very, very purple lips, where the other girl had low lip color. Mm -hmm. This girl has really, really purple lips. And that's just her natural her color? Her natural color. Okay. And so what I had to do with her is go the opposite way and warm up her lip color. So now she no longer looks cold. Right. Where the other gal had lots of choices on her color. Sure. This girl, she didn't have choices. When you have purple lips, the only thing you can do is put orange in to warm them up. Mm. But see how much prettier her complexion looks yes. now yes. with her lips? Warmer, warmer. Mm -hmm. Now, when people come and sit in your chair and, and uh, they're, you're helping them decide what mm. color, because the, the brows and the liner is right. the basic color, but the lips, you know, that's going to stand out. How do you help them come up you know, with the correct color for them? The easiest trick on any woman buying lipstick, whether I, I'm doing it permanently or they're just buying it for topical, is to try it on the end of your fingertips. Whatever the color on the end of your fingertip turns will be the exact color on your lips. Really? So you'll never, you know, you go in a store and they color your arm and then you get home and it's neon. <laughs> well, if you do your fingertips, it'll be the same as your lip tissue. So when somebody comes in, they sit in your chair, you're going to walk them through right. and say, this Right. And I usually tell people, bring me the color that you like, and uh, I'll tell you if it's a good choice for your lip tissue. Perfect. Perfect. There you go. Wake up beautiful. Why not? To book a consultation, contact Sally Hayes, permanent makeup artistry. She's located at 10201 North Scottsdale Road. That's in Scottsdale. You can call 480-951-0539. To see more before and after pictures and to learn more, go to permanent. PermanentMakeup.com.